Hello and welcome to day 11 of my 12 days of vlogmas. We're nearly there. So we are home. I'm just out walking to his lap. And Sebastian's on his bike having a lovely time. Excuse the exhausted looking face. Um, I had a bit of a palaver getting back from Disney yesterday. So we had to get the Euro Tunnel, but the day before they'd been striking. So there was a bit of an well, overflow of people that still wanted to get their Euro Tunnel train. So last night we queued for, I think, two, three hours. We were three hours delayed. So we got to the terminal at 7.50 and we didn't get onto a train until 11.30 French time. Um, so yeah. It took a long time. It's just getting through the border controls. It's actually the UK border controls. It took ages. Once we're through, we're fine, straight on the train, but it took absolutely ages. The car park was gridlock. It was horrendous. Um, but yeah, so we didn't get home until one o'clock UK time, which was two o'clock French time. So we're just a bit tired. Sebastian was good and he slept most of the way, but Kirsty and I are quite tired. So yeah, today going for a walk. Then I'm going to go back. Kirsty, Sebastian and I are going to have some lunch. Kirsty's gone to do the dreaded food shop. Yeah, shall we go that way? Yeah, could you stop at the bit where the fence starts? Could you go down, straight down? And then we'll stop where the fence starts, okay? Um, so yeah, Coast gone through the dreaded food shop, bless her. Good luck. Um, and then this afternoon, we're just going to Potter and get some jobs done. Maybe do some Lego. You want to do some Lego today, don't you? No, you changed your mind? Yeah, I thought you did. Some Lego this afternoon. I changed my mind. Oh, again? What do you want to do now? What are you doing instead this afternoon then? Uh, so I think that's what we'll do. Just take it easy. We're all a bit tired after a Lego land. Oh, not Lego land. Disney land. See, I'm so tired. I'm confusing it. Um, so yeah, and I might try and squeeze in a bit of Christmas present sewing. So I will catch up with you in a little bit. See you later. Hello. Thought I'd catch up with you. It is. What time is it? 5.30. Just been watching the lovely Rachel from Stitched Up. I've been catching up on Vlogmas because I've missed out on the last few days. Um, but yeah, I've just been in the sewing room. Can't show you what I've been sewing, but I will put a quick time lapse in. But um, don't look if you're a family member. <laughs> but yeah, we had a um, a nice walk this morning. Came back, had some quesadillas for lunch. That was yummy. Then Kirsty got back. She'd done the shopping. Then we helped put that away. Did some tidying up. Had a few people pop in cards which is nice some children that Kirsty's looked after over this last term as a childminder so that was really lovely um then Sebastian and Kirsty have been enjoying a movie together which has been lovely so I've nipped up here for a quick half an hour 45 minutes to quickly get some more Christmas presents done because I have left it to the last minute as always so yeah just had a quick bit of sewing time which was nice so yeah I'll put a little um a time lapse in of that um and then I'm going to go and make a stir fry for dinner and then this evening, Kirsty and I are going to do some wrapping and watch a movie together, which will be lovely. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go make dinner. See you in a bit. Julie sews her own clothes. I love her videos. Alright, let's get dinner out. Oh. Right, I'm in mushroom and uh, beef and vegetable stir fry tonight. Let me get out the beef. Ooh. 
so we're a bit lazy, always buy these pre-packed bags. Makes it so much quicker. And then we've just got a sirloin steak, but we'll just slice, slice up really thin, season it, then fry it off, and then I'll do the veggies afterwards. Get some noodles out. Need a couple of packets of noodles because there's just three of us eating tonight. Not just me and Kirsty asking to. So trim off some of the fatty bits before I slice it up. So, put that fat off the top. Right, and then I'm just going to cut it to nice little slices. Got a little dog down here who is hopeful. So, some food, aren't you, Rizzle? I'm afraid you're not getting any steak. It's not happening. We learnt this trick about the stir fry um, when Kirsty went on mad diets before she had Sebastian. Not mad as in silly, but mad as in she lost so much weight, she did really well. Just by eating really healthily and exercising lots. She lost three stone in three months, which was amazing. But um, yeah, this recipe is from the Hairy Bikers when it was their Hairy Dieters book. And they just sliced it up really thin. And it works really well in the stir fry. I'm going to season up the beef. Soy sauce, rice vinegar, bit of Worcestershire sauce, um, and then my secret ingredient is ketchup manis. Delicious, it's like a sweet and um, sort of soy sauce. It's really yum. Yeah, that's everything we need in there. Let's put those back. Um, yeah, that should be everything we need. I just wait for the pan to get hot and then we'll get sizzling some beef. I'm going to whiz this up for you. I had a lovely time cooking dinner and watching a couple of vlogs. I watched Julie and the lovely Adam from Adam Sews. Love catching up with him. He's always so lovely. I just love listening to him. He's wonderful. <laughs> he always makes me laugh as well. So yeah, um, now I'm going to have dinner and then Kirsty and I are going to have a nice chilled evening. Sebastian will have a nice uh, getting ready for bed session. I don't think it's bath time tonight. I think it's bath tomorrow night. Christmas Eve bath. 
Um, so yeah, tomorrow we'll have a bath, but so no bath tonight and just a nice bedtime story, some snuggles and going to bed in bed rather than falling asleep in the car, which will be nice. So yeah, I will catch up with you all tomorrow on Christmas Eve. Lots of love. Bye.